Friends, family, and others turned out to remember a young man shot and killed at a Newport apartment complex tonight. Nine on your side's John Genovese attended the memorial service for a young man gone too soon. And he is live right now with how D'Angelo Wilson's family and friends are coping. John? Yeah, that memorial service wrapping up just a short time ago here at Newport High School. The same spot where just two months ago D'Angelo Wilson received his high school diploma. And to his friends and family, he was known as Bubba. And tonight they're vowing to forever keep his memory alive. A small field lit up by candles. He was just a nice guy, like a community person. A brick wall bearing memories made with those who knew him best. He always gave off a positive vibe when you were down. He was the first person to make you smile. Smiles tonight rarely showing their face at a memorial service for 18-year-old D'Angelo Wilson. I just want his voice to be heard. I think this was a senseless crime and he did absolutely nothing nothing but be the best person that he could ever be. His mother is still left with more questions than answers. Police say a 17 year old shot and killed D'Angelo last night at a department complex off Bluegrass Avenue. I hope that he gets what he deserves and I'm going to fight for nothing but that. For those who saw him daily, he was more than a friend. We just really clicked together like brothers like you know it's like something I'll never have again like I'll never find with somebody else on like Bubba. It hasn't fully hit me yet. The fact that he's gone. Gone, but tonight not forgotten by this Newport community banding together to cope. A great die young, I guess, and he was a king in my heart, and I'm sure he was the same in everyone else's. And it remains unclear what may have prompted that shooting last night, and D'Angelo's mother says what she'll miss most of all hearing her son's laugh around the house. Reporting live tonight, John Genovese, 9 on your side.